Hello everyone, my name is Albert and welcome back to our Warhanity Studios video. So yeah, in this video I'm going to show you how to lip sync better or how you can lip sync a bit more easier and faster and yeah, better with better results. So yeah, it's not like the old metal that I did if, for those of you who don't know or around here appear something. And uh, yeah, let's begin. So first and first we're going to download the program called face and lips so yeah just click right here the button and it should it should download but i already did that so no need anymore for that so you're gonna get something like this uh zip file so yeah after you get this you're gonna get all of those you know screen even if you're using winrunner it's gonna appear that you know what I mean. So I advise you to simply make a new folder, call it face and lips. Uh, uh, if I create oh so then we can call it face and lips and all those and yeah. So yeah, you got this program and yeah. This whole folder makes for those of you who simply are I don't know, worried about space, well, yeah, it's a few megabytes. Anyway, so, Face and Lips is a program to help you a bit more, help you a bit more, I don't know how to call it, and you you know what I mean, when this thing opens, if it's gonna open. Uh, so first, it's gonna appear in Japanese, so how in the world do you change that? Right here, and English mode. So this tab help or how was what was this? So first tab, second and yeah from you can also click. So anyway, so we're first gonna import the WAV file. For those of you who know how to make a WAV file, well I did it in, in a video, the video is somewhere around here. And we're gonna go to desktop. I pre-recorded some stuff and yeah right now it's right here is a a WAV file. Um. Alright, so, hi. So, yeah, I um, simply know that doesn't sound too well because there's some sort of recording software settings and yeah, so let's import them all now. So, <clears throat> you know what, let's go with our model and this guy still do still doesn't have a name. So, uh, huh. no responding. Good job huh. looks a bit different from when I last used it I guess it was an update or something anyway so uh, huh. right here is the model as you can see and right here are all the morphs yep all the morphs so for now we won't need all those we'll simply need the mouth morph you can also edit like I don't know mouth morphs and yeah this one right here, here eye morphs and all the others and yeah for now we're gonna simply need the eye the yeah the facial expression morphs from the mouth <coughs> Jeez. anyway so we're gonna play again um all right so hi and you're gonna see right here you can also select this just simply press with your mouse and yeah just select it from the end from you know, so you simply need the syllables and yeah what are those well if your mouth opens once also try saying this like um so yeah your mouth open once and yeah the more mouth needs to open once so right here create on the more on the on the facial expression morph, morph slider on the mouth, you simply click the one that you want to use and it's like how much this to open this thing right here is controlling how much the mouth op opens and this is yeah how much the mouth opens if you go somewhere around like this and um all right and yeah so in this case we 
need to do this so we can make it um, a bit. All right. And yeah, you just simply got carefully added them. Um, all right. All I all right. I see an I here. So you simply gotta predict them. How to explain this for uh, so simply gotta predict them you say um, you hear the A or A, uh, and you simply press A, and if you hear something like right, press the I. So simply go A, A, A I, U, A, O, and yeah, I'm simply gonna have to teach someone. <sighs> Such um, all right. So, so yeah. Let's uh, keep continuing all of those. So you simply gotta test right. it till. So. So. Um, so. Oh. Right here. Uh, and you can also control all of those, like how much the thing takes, by just adjusting those two little dots right here you select from here from like this from where this edge comes it's simply adjusting the whole thing to go like a hundred four hundred fifty and yeah um all right so hi and right here last one hi i so we hear i we go i hi Hi, 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 hi. If the morph is if the morph is not right, just simply delete it. Press delete on your keyboard. Hi. Uh, hi. Let's go all this again. Um, all right. So, hi. And yeah, there we go. Um, we hi. have um, yeah, we have our model talking right now. And how to export this? Export VMD file. So you're gonna go right here, file name, uh, talk, and in this case, I want to delete the dot wave extension. I'm gonna need to leave it like this, so it doesn't mess up. You can also save this thing if you want to. And yeah, let's say uh, where's that folder? Face and lips, and let's say one one one. And yeah, I'll save, save as, yeah, you have it right here. So, so, uh, huh, we have now, we now have our motion, and uh, hmm, you can close, you can minimize, and let's wait for MMD to open. Doing your job. And finally, so let's load our model desktop uh, model and my model uh, there we go and load and load motion data and right here I'm gonna go talk well what happens right now the model talks but you cannot hear anything well this is because you gotta load the wave file load it play wow, wave file frame uh, let me get a better camera angle close this this right here register and yeah um all right so hi and yeah there we go this is how you lip sync like i don't know like a pro or easier better faster and yeah you simply need this program and yeah you can also if you like have bigger projects you can also save it and do all that uh, open and let's wait for it to load and do all this job huh. 
not responding. And yeah, this program is kind of crashy sometimes. I remember this program crashing like mad one day. So yeah, I really hope you enjoy. And if you do, smash the like button. And of course, if you if you simply really really want to make me happy, just click the subscribe button. It doesn't take that long. So yeah, I was Albert from Rohingya Studios. Thank you for watching. Bye.